I'm Pastor George Cook, Nehemiah Center, sometimes called the Patriot Pastor. How are you all? Hello, Come on, you gotta get charged up here. How are you all? There you go. Thank you so much. Hey, you know what? What is it? Two days ago, Nelson Mandela died. All right, I'm sorry to hear that a communist died, but the President of the United States right now is trying to paint himself as the new Nelson Mandela, and I want to support him in that, and I think he should go to prison for 27 years at a bare minimum. Don't give up the fight. Do not think that because you only see 30 or 40 people standing here that it is meaningless. It is not. I was just speaking with some friends from my other home state in Arkansas, Northwest Arkansas, open carry, had a huge victory just this year. They got constitutional carry. Now, if you don't know what that means, that means that they no longer require a license to carry a firearm. That's it, period, end of discussion. And I am happy to say that my home county in Springfield, Arkansas, had their very first ever in lifetime open carry march two days before Thanksgiving. And what was I doing up here in Pennsylvania? I should have been down there celebrating with them. We need to fight for all of the gun rights that we have and more. We need constitutional carry in this state. We have it. Except that, yeah, Bill, we have it, except that they're still asking us to have a license to conceal carry. Right? Your choice is no license, period, end of discussion. I'm an American citizen. The Second Amendment is my license to carry a firearm. Right. There was no such a thing when our founding fathers wrote the Constitution. They would, you know what, I hear them spinning in their graves when they see the regulations that are already in place and the ones that they want to put in place even more so. It was mentioned already that New York City is trying to tell people that have, are you ready for this, a 22 caliber bolt action rifle that holds six rounds to turn it in, sell it, or destroy it because it's an assault weapon. They've got to be out of their minds. This is privately owned property. You have the right to keep it. You have the right to carry it. Don't give up the fight. Forward and march on. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, Pastor. Anybody else?